So what are the instructions that a RISC-V um, architecture can perform? Well, addition is one of the basic uh, operations that's commonly used. So here's our high-level code, our C code. Um, we have A equals B plus C. The RISC-V or the equivalent RISC-V assembly code has a mnemonic, this add mnemonic that helps us remember, hey, what is this operation doing? It's performing addition. Here's the destination, A, and here are two source operands, B and C. So this is performing that operation, A equals B plus C. Subtract is very similar. The only difference here, we have A equals B minus C. And so we simply change that mnemonic from add to subtract. So we have subtract, here's our, again our destination, and our two source operands. A equals B minus C. So here's our, uh, an illustration of our first design principle. Simplicity favors regularity. So if we have a consistent instruction format, so for example, add and subtract are consistent, they have the same number of operands, two source operands, one destination, and they start with the mnemonic, um, it's gonna be easier to encode and handle in hardware, as opposed to the opposite case, suppose we have one instruction that has, you know, three operands, the other one has 10 operands, one has five, we can keep this simple and um, have this regularity in our design, it will um, make it easier and simpler to design the, uh, and encode and design, design the hardware. So we can build um, more complex or um, implement more complex instructions by using multiple of these simple instructions of these RISC-V instructions. So here's a you know, quote more complex line of code. It's not that complex, but to illustrate, so A equals B plus C minus D, if we're gonna add this temporary location to, to um, place a, a, a temporary calculation. So our temporary calculation is T equals B plus C. And then, so here's our T value, and then A equals T minus D. And so we perform this line of code in two RISC-V instructions. So this is design principle two. Um, we're gonna make the common case fast. So RISC-V includes only simple commonly used instructions. Like we saw add and subtract. We don't have an add subtract instruction that does both. Well, it's gonna be more, um, you know, more complexity in the number of operands and more complex complexity in the encoding. So now we have more instructions where we could have actually done that operation. And we showed in the previous slide how we did that with two of these more simple instructions, add followed by subtract. So um, this is called a reduced instruction set computer or risk um, computer because it has a small number or reduced number of instructions. This is opposed to uh, CISC architectures or complex instruction set computers, CIS computers, such as Intel's x86, where the number of operands does vary widely, the number of, of instructions, a lot of them. And so um, instead we're going to opt for a risk um, architecture where we stick to a, a number of, a small number of simple operations.